The crypto entrepreneurs, Tyler and Cameron Winklevoss, well, they've just made their first ever acquisition and the duo behind the company they bought couldn't be more similar. Get this, it's Duncan and Griffin Cockfoster who are also identical twins. What? What? The Winklevi, as some people call them, were Olympic rowers and cockfosters. They rowed at high school too. The company they sold to the Winklevosters is called Nifty Gateway. And it lets people basically buy digital assets with a credit card. It, we don't know the terms. We don't know how much the Winklevoss twins have paid out for this set of twins. They're only buying three people who are actually part of this company in the Nifty Gateway. By the way, Nifty is basically a collectible in crypto. So do you remember those crypto kitties that were going berserk about a year or so ago? You're talking language I can't even begin to understand. <laughs> you could collect these sort of uh, digital cats, basically, designs of kittens that became collectible in some way. It was called a crypto kitties game. And because they were one of a kind, they inherently had value. But the idea is that eventually you tokenize all sorts of assets. You have art, you have collect stamps, comic books, but this will make it just so much easier to be able to buy into them rather than having to open a digital wallet and have to go to an exchange. You can just use credit card. So we know that the Winklevoss twins like to buy crypto kitties. Yeah, but okay. so does everyone. I mean, Novogratz was in on it. There were huge auctions that were selling for like a million. It was crazy. Uh, it's, I mean, this is like, you can't make this stuff up.